What's up guys? In this tutorial, I'll show you how to save a WhatsApp voice message to your mobile device. While WhatsApp doesn't provide a direct way to save voice messages to your gallery, you can still save them on your phone's file manager, which allows you to store and access these audio files whenever you need them. This method is straightforward and ensures that your important voice messages are saved permanently on your device. First, open a WhatsApp chat where the voice message you want to save is located. Once you found the voice message, tap and hold it. Holding it down will bring up a menu with multiple options. In this menu, you want to select Forward. This option allows you to select the voice message for further actions. Now, look at the bottom right corner of the screen. You see a share icon, which typically looks like an upward arrow coming out of a box. Tap on this icon to bring up the share sheet window which displays various apps and actions you can take with the selected file. In the Share Sheet window, scroll down until you find the option labeled Save to Files. This option is crucial because it allows you to store the voice message directly on your phone's file manager, which is usually named Files on most devices. Tap on Save to Files. Once you've tapped on Save to Files, you'll be prompted to choose a name for your audio file and select the location where you want to save it. You can pick a specific folder or create a new one to keep your voice messages organized. After you've entered the desired name and chosen the location, tap Save in the upper right corner of your screen. This action will save the voice message as an audio file in your chosen location. To confirm that your voice message has been successfully saved, close WhatsApp and open your phone's File Manager app. Navigate to the folder where you save the audio file. Once you find it, Tap on a file to play it. You should hear the exact same voice message that was sent to you on WhatsApp. Now, store it permanently on your device. I hope this helped you out. Leave a comment if you have any questions and see you in the next one.